Hey this is Adam and in this video I'm going to show you how to fix damaged baseboards. In the last one we replaced some and depending on the damage you have you might want to just swap it out. This baseboard's really long and the damage isn't so great that I'm just going to patch it instead. And what I'm doing here is mixing up some joint compound and this is the same stuff you use as a surface coat on drywall. This isn't like a special top coat or anything like that. And this stuff is great because it's very easy to work with. The only thing you have to remember is you're doing several coats. But the coats are fast, so it's okay. Here you can see a close-up of the damage. A part has broken off, and usually baseboards like this are going to be made out of not solid wood, but wood fibers pressed together. First thing I'm going to do is spread on some joint compound. And sometimes it's hard to stick, so you might want to just use your fingers to get it into the fibers. Now that I have some on, I'm going to use a drywall blade that's at least twice as long as the damage I'm trying to fix. And here's the trick. I'm going to move the blade from left to right as I'm following the contour of the molding. The first coat's going to be really bad. You're not trying to fill the whole thing in. You're just trying to put some in. So I'm going to let this dry and come right back. Now that it's dry, I can add a second coat. I'm going to do exactly the same as I did the first coat. I'll let that dry and I'll do a third coat. Spreading this does not take long at all, so it's not really a pain to do this many coats. Once the coats are dry and you want to refine the edges, wrap a piece of sandpaper around a block and you can get into the grooves easier. Also just using your finger can work to wipe away some of the irregularities. Now that I'm done sanding, I'm going to do one final coat and let that dry and then I'll sand it one more time. Then you just apply your paint and you're all done. And I really hope this has helped you guys. If you have any questions, go ahead and ask and I'll do my best to answer as always. You can leave the questions in the comments section. Also, if you'd like to donate and support this channel, please do so. You can click the links for that. And uh, I'll see you guys next time. Have an awesome day.